Guitars are cool, but you know what's really cool? When you accidentally stumble into a go-to guitar. Guitars are cool with Mac Weber. Yeah, that's me. I was heading back to my hotel after the third and concluding day of the Dallas International Guitar Festival. And I was greeted by some nice guys in the lobby who were complimentary of my performances during the weekend. And they subsequently introduced me to their friend and luthier, Mike J. Franks of MJ Franks Guitars and Cirrus Guitars. And as the conversation progressed, I was handed this guitar, and I immediately found that it contained a more refined sound that I did not already have in my arsenal. Definitely inspired by that brand out of Nazareth, but this one's nice and light. They dug my playing and I dug their guitar, so in that moment, I became an artist for their brand and I walked away with this guitar. So here's the test. I pulled out every rosewood back and side acoustic that I own for a comparison to see how this one stacks up to the competition. This includes a Martin D28, Martin D35, and also a Guild Jumbo. Which one do you like best? Let me know in the comments down below. So obviously this guitar is somewhat comparable to my D28, but I think this one feels significantly lighter. I love a light top on my acoustic because the soundboard is where the action is, and I don't want any extra mass getting in the way of the tone. I also dig that these guitars have nice tight grain Adirondack spruce tops, rather than Sitka, and the backs and sides are old growth Indian rosewood. You don't find that kind of stuff on factory guitars. And this guitar is not overly decorated as a cost-cutting feature, but I feel like that plays into this guitar feeling like it really breathes. It looks new now, but with the thin finish, this thing will age fast, just the way I like it. But the one thing it's missing is a pickup, because I intend to use this during my live gigs with my band. So we're going to have to take a little road trip to Michigan to visit Mike and get them to install a pickup in this guitar. Let's go. All right, we're heading to Sterling Heights, Michigan. We got the guitar in the back. Ready to go. So now we're back from Sterling Heights, Michigan. I gotta tell you, Mike J. Franks and Company, stellar. That place really is awesome and the hospitality and love that we felt in the workshop was spectacular, second to none. And the big news right here, I got a cable coming out of my guitar. You know what that means? They installed a pickup. Not just any pickup, 
This is the JJB Prestige pickup and it has a volume control. Check that out. So I'd say this pickup is comparable to the K&K Pure Mini that we all know and love. It's a transducer pickup with three little things underneath the soundboard. But it's got a volume control unlike the K&K Pure Mini. And it's also made in Michigan, the same state that the Cirrus guitars are made in. So that's damn cool. I love it. I think it sounds great. So I'm going to give it to you straight. This is the JJB Prestige pickup going straight in. <laughs> But I wanted to make it a little bit crazier because I am a crazy man and I wanted to make an impulse response, an IR of this exact guitar and run it into my HX stomp and this is what it sounds like now. It just sounds a bit bigger. It sounds more like this guitar with a nice scooped mid-range and a boomy, boomy bottom end. I say it's a win-win. The JJB Prestige pickup has it going on, but if you add a little bit of an IR impulse response to this guitar, it does get a little bit better. So now we're going to put this guitar through the paces, through the context of song. I got a new record out called Stereogram, and on it is a track entitled Head Start. So now we're going to showcase this guitar along with my voice and the song with just two microphones. Let's hit it. something to show someday all the places I'll go it's just taking some time it's all gonna be fine all I need is a head start don't need anything more than just my shit. All I need is a head start. I may not be first, but I'll still make it there. All my demons will die. With the times that I've cried in vain And my thoughts will comply Lose the feelings of shame And never more the same All I need is a head start All I need is a head start I may not be first But I'll still get you there Words softer than a lullaby Your warm sleeping body by my side Gentle thoughts can simply pacify My worried mind can sit aside And wait until tomorrow All my rivers will flow And surely some of them will go my way All my friends I still know They're sitting by my side And they're here to stay Never gonna get away All I need is a head start Don't need anything more than just my share All I need is a head start I may not be first But I'll still make it Will I still make it? 
I'm telling you that I'll still make it, baby. I'll still make it there. Yeah. So guitars are cool. And you know this guitar is cool. And I certainly wouldn't be repping this guitar if I didn't think that it was truly something spectacular. It's keeping my Martins in the closet. Thanks a bunch for sticking around this long for this episode of Guitars Are Cool. Hit that like button, subscribe, do all that kind of YouTube stuff so that we can make more of these videos. Thanks a bunch. I'm Michael Weber. Guitars are cool with Michael Weber. Yeah, that's me.